times have changed and change is difficult and of course it's a lot easier to complain but we are not doing that we are just becoming more creative and this is the reason we're doing this video before i share two really nice stories about AMSET, i would like to share a personal story and this is about two friends they cannot disagree more in absolutely every subject but one thing they both absolutely agree is that art is relevant and art is important and art can make a society and a community better of course they don't know that they both agree so strongly on the same subject and that really made me feel so good about what I'm doing as an artist but also what the museum is doing art matters and and that was a good confirmation one of the stories that i would love to share with you is a summer camp is um about 20 little ones and i am naive and brave enough to propose i can do a paper mache and i do it and it was one of the most wonderful experiences because we still talk about it after years they told me how they still had their little piece of paper mache in their house somewhere in the living room or their bedroom and the best part about this is that they come in to me with with questions and they have paste in their forehead or by their mouth and i'm thinking are they eating this paste and uh no they were not eating the paste but even now there's still great memories that are not going anywhere the volunteers remember every uh, single day because they worked so hard and it wasn't possible it would have been absolutely impossible without them so thank you thank you volunteers they're also so so great and they know how much i love them and that is one of the reasons we we support the museum so much is because these memories will not go away hopefully for a long time or ever the other story is about my, one of my students and he visit, I took him to the museum last week and he enjoyed himself, very, very smart, intelligent kid. But as we live in the museum, he tells me that he's never been in the museum before and he was really happy that he was in there. But to me, it was almost a shock. I'm like, how, how is it that he's never been to the museum? So this is when I realized that myself, everywhere I go, one of the first things I look is, where is the museum? And I find it, and I know that's what people are gonna do when they come and visit Bowman. One of the first places they're gonna look for is the museum. But before we reach them and before we worry about them, we have to uh, make sure we reach in our own community and we're doing that. The next event, as I said, we're just becoming more creative, is a drive-through, where instead of them or us doing the activities with them, they will be able to drive by and pick up different things to take home. So this is a good example of growth. We are not saying there's nothing we can do. We are going for it. We doing things differently. And um, I just want to thank everyone uh, for the support and hope that um, they're just, we're going to come out of this stronger. So thank you so much. Very honored to be doing this video for you. And until next time, your friend Ines Alvidres.